Welcome to Warbreaker Coo's Reviews. I'm your host, Warbreaker Coo. And today we're looking at Marvel Legends House of X Cyclops. Now this is a pretty, pretty cool figure. Um, pretty sweet. I like it a lot, but I like Cyclops a lot as well. So there's that. As far as his look to the comics, I feel like it's fairly accurate. We got a picture of his suit right here from X-Men number three, him and Emma. Um... I do still say they need to get him on, on a taller buck. He needs to be taller, and he needs to be a little bit more buff. Look at this, okay? Cyclops is not, you know, cap. he's not the bucky cap buck. He should be a little bit beefier up, up in the chest. I mean, he used to be slim, but this is the modern Cyclops, okay? He's a lot, you know, he's a lot more stacked, yes, if you will. Um, but, yeah, besides those two sentiments, they're pretty clean with their lines. Um, as you can see, lines are really clean. I like the um, pinless technology here. So you can see he has no pins on his elbows. Uh, pins on his legs, which are odd. So I don't understand why they went pinless tech for the top, but not the bottom portion. Um, the head is really clean. It gives me an astonishing X-Men vibe. Um... In classic vibe. I like his pouches. They're very well painted. Let's get this out of the way because this, this picture is throwing everything off. There we go. Let's focus on this guy. Focus on this guy. So, yeah, the belt's really clear. Really like that belt. Like it quite a bit. And he's got some nice little gauntlets that he also had in the uh, comic. So, they did a good job. They did a bang up job. Now, if they would have left it there, I would have been okay. I would have felt like I'm, I'm missing a bit. But, you know, they also threw in the head from the um, retro Cyclops. And I hate this pen. This peg is really, really frustrating. I like the, the face, how he looks back right there. But they don't stop there. They also give you the optic blast. So... He's finally got some, you know, effects going on here. It looks pretty dang good, you know. Get that little feeling, and I, I almost, I'm, I'm getting kind of tired of getting this hand. To be honest with you, Cyclops doesn't have to have those anymore. He doesn't need to have the hands. He also has them in his, uh, his hands as well. Um, so he doesn't have to have just his pose. Okay. Um, I mean, it looks good. You know, but he doesn't need to do that all the time. So, I wish we would have got another fisted hand. And I'm sure I probably have a fisted hand somewhere around here. I just have to see if I can match this color. Because I'd rather have two fisted hands um, than the Jean Grey, you know, that hand. So, <laughs> so that's what I would prefer. Um, let's get him compared to some of his other, some of the other Cyclops I have in my collection. And by other, I don't mean all of them. I don't have a lot. Um, I should have got the X Factor in hindsight, but I really didn't care for that costume that much. So, I didn't. So, here are all my Cyclopses. Or Cyclops. Um, there is a Jean Grey two-pack one. There's those fingers again. Here's the Love Triangle Cyclops. And you can see, I kept the finger out of it this time. And then finally, here is a Jim Lee Cyclops from the uh, Warlock Wave. So those are all my Cyclops. So, yeah. I mean, it's, you know, it, I, again, it's a, it's a good Cyclops. It's a good Cyclops. Um, the one costume that I wish I had is actually the one I'm going to show you right now. Um, this is the one Marvel Legend that I wish I would have bought. Uh, but I wasn't collecting back then. I really want this suit. One of these days, I'll probably pick it up from somewhere. Because I really need this one in my collection. But yeah, that's this is the suit that's, that's banging. But overall, um, I, I must say, it's a, it's a good pickup. If I had to rate it out of 10, I would give this the, the new Cyclops 
what would I give it? I give it a solid 8.5. This just needs a new buck. This just needs a new buck, some hand accessories, and then you'll be good to go. But um, yeah, that's about it. Until next time, peace and Cyclops Grease, baby.